What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of a Super Cooper Sunday! What's up Coop? He is on another level today. Oh my goodness. Does he know what's happening? Does he know our special plans? Have you told him yet? I'm drinking a glass of water. He knows nothing. <laughs> oh my goodness. So today we are going to be getting in the holiday spirit and we are going to be decorating the house. And Chelsea has already been doing little bits and pieces. We have some like, what is that called? Tinsel? Yeah, we need more. On the stairs. We've got to get more of that. We've got kind of like some various wintry Christmassy decorations and stuff out. But you guys can see we do not have our tree up yet. So that's going to be going up today, which should be interesting. You guys know Cooper always freaks out about that. Coda has a good time with it too, so we're going to be putting that up, but we thought because last episode we got that like Thanksgiving turkey thing and Cooper was freaking out about it and Coda had like a funny reaction to it and stuff like that too, we thought maybe we should get some Christmas decorations and uh, rather than just ordering it off Amazon, I think we're going to take Coop to Home Depot. Now we would take Coda too, but he just like, he doesn't... He doesn't like that. He doesn't like to go outside his routine. He likes to go to the park and he'll run for literally like five minutes and then he's like done. So I just, I don't want to go get into Home Depot and have him be like, hey, I'm fed up with this. I don't want to be here anymore and lay down we or can't carry him for the store. He's too big. pee on the floor or anything like that because <laughs> sometimes that's how he tends to get. So I think we're going to take Coop because we can literally pick him up and put him in the cart if he gets tired. And we're going to go, we're going to try to find some yard decorations and just decorations in general and then we're gonna bring them back, we're gonna decorate the house. I don't know, it just should be an interesting day. And uh, don't worry bud, you won't, you won't have to work too hard, all right? You can just stay here, you can take a nice little nap and then we're gonna have some very scary decorations when we come back that you're gonna have to protect us from. Coop, you ready? You ready? You wanna go for a ride? Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Woo! Good boy. Trying to decide where he's gonna sit. Looks Not like there. looks like you're sitting in the back. Sorry, Chels. No. I don't think she's gonna like you sitting there, Coop. I don't know that this is gonna work. Coopy, go in the back. <laughs> go in the back. All right. One thing we did notice. Like two days ago, this truck was in for maintenance. We got like new brakes and pads and all kinds of stuff. Um, Cooper only likes truck rides. We yeah. were taking her car to different places and we, we brought him one time and he like, he got really weird and he was like tail between his legs, like not really he into didn't it. He enjoy it at all. Yeah, and it, it, it was just like, I mean, other than that, the entire day he was normal. It's not like he wasn't feeling well or something. But yeah, as soon as we got the truck back, we, I think Chelsea, so we like picked him up and took him for a quick ride or something and he was all about it. So he, he likes he likes being up high and being able to see everything. You can't be up here. <laughs> he just wants to sit in your lap. No. <laughs> Kubi, come here. <laughs> come on. <laughs> there we go, that's a good spot. We've already got a cart for him. We've got to prevent the craziness, buddy. We don't want you to be jumping all over the place and going crazy and this is this is going to be interesting. Oh. <laughs> Day. I don't know if this is going to work. <laughs> So this is our little Christmas area. The one I can already tell that I want is that dragon up there. What do you think, Coop? What do we need? We've got deer up here, decorative wire reindeer. We've got snowmen. There's a giant, oh, look at that. A four foot golden, a light up golden. That's actually pretty perfect. We have so many cool options. That Yeti's awesome. The dragon's awesome. The Hula Hawaiian Santa is awesome. A nine foot Santa, a nine foot snowman, a soccer Santa, an ATAT -AT with a Santa hat. How about this one? We like this one. The puppy wagon scene? Like the merry wagon. Oh God. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 
What is it, Coop? What is it? <laughs> I can't tell if he likes it or not. The giant Yeti looking thing, uh, I think is sold out. We couldn't find it. Instead, we got this. This is six and a half feet. It's an animated polar bear. And this is kind of the face Coda makes when he plays, so that's what we went for. Chelsea is asking if they have it in stock. He is very concerned about this entire situation. He does not like her being over there. Oh no. Oh no, the standoff is happening. You have to stay, you have to stay. Could we stay? You're gonna knock my stuff off. <laughs> it's okay. This is not the best idea we've ever had. <laughs> he's getting plenty of attention, but he's also being really naughty. When he saw that other little dog, he was freaking out. He I doesn't- I did not care about him at all. We have too much stuff. I feel kind of bad that he's getting squished. He's not squished, he's fine. <laughs> they said they have a few other things out here, so we're gonna check this and I think we're done. He's much more behaved out here. Yeah, he's like, oh, you like the succulent? Oh, Those you like the nice. flowers? Coopy, what do you think? You know, there are lots of plants here he could pee on. All they have out here are more trees and stuff. We are hoping for, like, smaller decorations and tinsel and stuff, so. We might have to make a Walmart run later. Yeah. Without the dog. But I feel like we did pretty well. <laughs> Alright, good sir. Your chariot awaits. Good boy! There he goes, right back into the chuck. You're what? Boy. An exciting adventure to start the day. Alright guys, so now that our shopping's done, we decided to stop and get a little lunch before we go home and do decorations. So we're at Chipotle. I don't think you can see. And Koopi is here while Trevor goes and gets us our food. He's really enjoying this being outside thing. Every time that the door opens to the restaurant, the entrance is over here, every time it opens, Cooper thinks it's gonna be Trev and it's so sad. He's gonna be right back, Bunny. He'll be right back. The Chipotle worker, she saw Coop, so she brought out some water and stuff for him. That's what you guys just saw there. And as she was walking away, she was like, oh, he's such a good boy, he's so calm. You got her tricked. <laughs> <laughs> Dude! <laughs> what is this, buddy? My what are you doing? So... <laughs> and you have dog. Oh no, he just stuck his <laughs> Welcome back home! Woo! Oh my goodness, it's so exciting, right, Coda? Alright, so you guys know we got all that stuff from Home Depot, but Chelsea also went to Walmart because they didn't have the little things that she yeah. wanted. So basically, we got the stuff that we want to use out of the garage. Our tree is in two bags over here. We're gonna put that together. We have all of our ornaments in this box here. And then this is all the stuff that we just got today. So uh, we've got some new, like, I don't even know. Can you call this a wreath? Tidings Teardrop. It's like a long wreath. We have two of those. We, of course, got the golden retriever, and we honestly don't even know what we're doing with these. I don't know if I want to put yard decorations out, because part of me feels like that's cool. Part of me feels like it's, like, kind of not as classy. I don't know. We're going to figure it out. But, regardless, it's going to be funny for this episode. So, we got the golden retriever. We're going to set that up. We got the, uh, the hula santa, which actually, like, dances, which is going to be kind of cool. He's going to be flossing or something. I don't know. And then we've got this giant polar bear, which we want to uh, to see what Coda thinks of. So that's going to be kind of cool, right, Coop? What do you think about that? Then it looks like Chelsea got some tinsel. Oh, how exciting! Woo! Tinsel, <laughs> tinsel. It's so exciting. So we got that. We got some little decorative trees. What do you think about that, Coop? Pretty nice. What else do we have? Oh gosh, what is this? Is this a dog toy? Well, no, but in our house it probably is going to end up being. This is going to end. It's supposed to be a decorative pillow. Oh, it's a decorative pillow, but it looks like an ornament. Coda, check it out. <laughs> I think. Did you get three of these? They're what did you get these for? Target. They're only a dollar each. That's not bad. Coda, Coda, look, look. 
Almost. That thing is gonna be ripped to shreds. These. These are not very strong, I can tell, no, and this this boy's going crazy. Here you go. You want to try it? What if we made you into a tinsel boy? You're tinsel. Nice. A good-looking tinsel boy. Yay! You look fabulous, Coda. <laughs> Let's wrap it around your tail here. Oh, so pretty. <laughs> Oh look, now we have two tinsel boys. Cooper doesn't have quite enough body mass to fully wrap it all the way around. <laughs> Good boy, Cooper, are you a Christmas pop? <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Let's see what else she got. She got uh, 300 clear mini lights. She got a couple boxes of that, as well as some more tinsel. We've got, oh my God. Are you serious? <laughs> oh my gosh. Do you want to wear this? So we've got that and then we've got a little hat that Coop can put on. Coop, come here. Look at that. You got a nice Christmas hat on. Well, the thing is, is the ear, the ear holes, <laughs> the ear holes don't really fit. <laughs> Good boy. Get it. Get your ball. Go get it. Good boy. <laughs> That is so cute. Coda, let me see your, yeah, your ear holes don't fit either. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a more depressed reindeer in my life. This is what I get when I send her to Walmart with my credit card. Oh my goodness. Coop, this, this is cute, but it can't be comfy, right? Unfortunately, our boys have big heads and big ears, so it just doesn't really work. Mini lights, clear mini lights, okay. We've also got Another ball. Oh, a pink one. Yay! That's exciting. Got a pink one. What do we have in here? Battery operate. Okay, this is cool. So actually, our neighborhood, I don't know if we're gonna end up doing a vlog for this, but we'll definitely like throw it in a video or we'll put it on social or something. But our neighborhood does a boat parade every year, and obviously we got the pontoon boat, so we're gonna dress up the pontoon boat. I think we're gonna put that hula Santa on the front of it, and then we're gonna have like battery operated Christmas lights all over the pontoon boat, and then everybody kind of light, like lights up their boats and decorates their boats, and then they all cruise around all night. So we're definitely gonna be doing that. I think we could even, you know what, Chelsea, we could totally put these, like wrap these around the boys and turn them into walking oh, yeah. Christmas trees. That'd be kind of fun. He's gonna help us come hang it up. No, we gotta hang it up, buddy. Look how nice. Well, like that. it's not centered. <laughs> That's much better. Do you like it? Is it nice? We did a good job. <laughs> He's so excited. We're putting up one and a half feet fake trees and it's like the most exciting moment that he has ever experienced. Here we go. He's right there. He's ready. Are we going back out front? Nope. We're already done with outside coop. We're getting him over here. Mm, you get double help today. <laughs> I'm going to go get the other tree now. Just going to inspect them. Make sure that they're up to, up to code. Actually, just put them in place. Is there something in here that he's looking for? No. He was rearranging the trees, babe. Cooper, that was weird. That was really weird. Do the trees fit your preference? Do you like where they are? Are you 100% sure? He has no clue what I'm asking him. <laughs> so this has been our life. Ever since she put these up a couple days ago, you just put it up wrong. You gotta flip it. So they're all facing the same direction. We don't really have like a fireplace. Technically that's a fireplace, but we obviously don't have like a mantle we can put it on. So Chelsea's always put them here, but Cooper kind of treats it as like an agility course to like run in between and yeah, see if he can. He, he tries to knock them all down. He tries to see how many he can knock down as quick as possible. So we're always picking those up. All right. The... <laughs> 
This time he didn't take down the entire anchor type thing. So we're just gonna put that back. All right, anyway, what's next? Tinsel, it's tinsel time, Coop. What is it, Coop? You like tinsel that much? You're just so happy that we're putting it all over the house? Do you guys remember on that first, the very first time that we all had a Christmas tree together and he grabbed the tinsel and ripped it off the tree? Yep. Cooper, we're trying to put garland on the tree. Dota, come here, buddy. Come, come on. Do you wanna come join the tinsel time with us? Come on, good boy, come here. Yeah. I want to see. Maybe, maybe this time will be different from the other hundreds that we've tried. Come on. Come here. Good boy. Come on. No. That's a no. Trevor's trying to move the love sack here. Oh. Oh my gosh, it's a blue elephant. Did you know that was there? No. There's He's been waiting for this day forever. He just... Goopy. <laughs> Oh, we got a board blanket too. He got his blue elephant. I didn't even know that was missing. This used to be his favorite blanket. Look, how nice. We're there not going go. to bed with it. You're not going to the bed. There you go. <laughs> Can we come on? And now, it's time to put the tree up. First things first, let's put the skirt on, Coop. We gotta put the skirt on the tree. There you go. That's exactly what we're looking for. We need lots of help. You're on me. You're on me. <laughs> you know, it's a good thing that once a year we put this giant jungle gym in the middle of the living room for him. He brought you a toy in case you wanted to play under there. Because that's that's what this is for, is it's like a little cave to play with toys in. You're on the blanket! <laughs> so one really nice thing is that we have a pre-lit tree. I've had this tree for like four or five years now. Heck, me and this tree have been together longer than you and I have, girl. Barely. Barely. But uh, it's really nice. Unfortunately, when I got Coop, he really liked to chew on the wires when he was a little puppy. So sometimes this thing's a little finicky. I think we're probably going to have to end up getting a new one in the next year or two. But uh, I think I have all the connections hooked up. Chelsea's going to turn this thing on. And we're going to see. Let's see what it is. Boom, look at that, Coop, woo! Coda, do you see how beautiful that is? Come here, come here, come on, come look. Oh my goodness. I don't think we've had a year together where we haven't had to mess with this thing and like try to fix it somehow. Oh, the metal is always out, like this section right here. I am amazed, oh my goodness. But yeah, look at that, we literally just put the tree together, you connect a couple of wires and then you turn it on and it's good to go. You don't actually have to wrap lights around it, so. After that, we've got ornaments and tinsels that we're putting on it, Chels. Do you not remember the story of the tree? Not fully. You bought the tree like the spring before we were together. So it was in a box our first Christmas. And Koopy chewed through the box and chewed through the wire. He wouldn't do that. He did. And then they double teamed us because while we were trying to figure out why the bottom of the tree, like one chunk wouldn't light, he peed on the tree. You wouldn't do that. Work. So he peed on it and then he shorted it and one of these days it's probably gonna catch on fire But we're gonna knock on wood and hope that that doesn't happen. I think we underestimated the tinsel that we had We've got like two rows and that's pretty much it. So we're gonna have to go out and get some more later So this is the ball that Cooper tried to eat. It's that you're doing it again. This is what it used to look like. You can see the massive glitter difference here. You're crazy. He tried to take it right out of my hand. And 
now for the final piece. Coop, we gotta put the star up there. You ready? Come here. Come on. Here we go. We're gonna put the star up there. Oh no, he can't reach. Well, I guess Chelsea's gonna have to do I it. I dread this part every year. Here we go. Oh my god, okay. <sighs> girl are you ready no this is gonna be good so uh we put the boys in the extra bedroom over here we're just gonna keep them kind of unaware of what's happening out here and we're gonna set all three of these up so again we've got a six foot animated led santa hula dancer we've got a uh a six and a half foot animated led polar bear with sign that says do not feed the bears and then we've got a four foot golden retriever here so uh, we're gonna see what they think about these things literally we're just gonna unbox them set them up get them going like right here in the middle of the room we'll open up the door we're gonna bring them out and we'll just kind of get their reactions like i said i don't know exactly what we're gonna do with these i don't know if we're gonna end up using this one i'm not sure this one we're definitely gonna use on the boat and then maybe i was thinking in our balcony upstairs outside of the bedroom be kind of a cool spot for it this We'll probably end up using somewhere. I don't know if we want to put stuff out in the front yard or what, but uh, if you guys have any ideas, feel free to let us know. But yeah, we're going to get these things set up and we'll see what they think. Girl, what's wrong with his legs? I'm working on it. He's doing this thanky leg. Santa is flossing. And I feel like this one's going to really freak coat out because the head will just like abruptly turn out of nowhere. I don't know, these are, these are kind of cool. I think Hula Santa is by far my favorite. Here we go, oh my goodness. Scoop, don't attack Santa Claus. Coda swerved it right away. <laughs> Coop's going to the puppy. Oh, Coop! You broke him! Coda is so sketched out right now. <laughs> I'm worried he's gonna pee. Coda, come here, look. Look at this twerking Santa. Look at that bravery. Oh my goodness, look at this. Doesn't this look like you? I really want him to be like close to it when it turns. Koda, come here, look. <laughs> <laughs> he does not like this at all. <laughs> the dog is back alive. We fixed it up. Oh, he's missing a head. This is a little bit morbid. We got a golden retriever and it was beheaded within the first couple minutes of having him. <laughs> oh, look at this leg, babe. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> He's literally taking it apart piece by piece. Koopy, who is that? He doesn't like it. He does not like the dog. He does not want another four-legged friend to take any more attention from him. Meanwhile, we've got this guy over here completely sketched out, not wanting to participate. All right, guys, so there you have it. That's our little Christmas kind of, not celebrating, but decorating episode, I guess. We're definitely going to, uh, to have an actual Christmas like opening and stuff like that later on. Actually, next week, I think we might be taking the boys to meet Santa Claus for the first time ever. Oh, we have yeah. never been able to do that before. We have never found an opportunity to bring your dog and I think we found one, so you guys stay tuned for that. We're probably gonna go downtown, walk around a little bit, pick out some, some treats at Wolfgang and stuff like that. Wolfgang is actually where it's happening and then, I don't know, maybe make some like Christmas dog treats afterwards or something like that. And uh, then, after that episode, it's his fourth birthday. So we've got, we've got some bangers coming up soon. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're going to see you guys later. Peace out.